timing is what makes a good story a great story. My name is Paul Ripke, I'm 40 years old. I live in Newport Beach, California. And if you ask me what I do, it's storytelling, probably. I started my career as a photographer in music and hip hop. After doing that for a couple of years, I felt like it's time for a change. So I stopped music and started soccer. I got quite lucky. The team I followed, they won a title. <laughs> it was a good night. But after that, once again, I stopped and needed a new challenge. Motorsport came into my life. Not the cars, the human side of motorsport. In the four following years, I captured a couple of titles. I told stories of titles. But 2019, I probably took the hardest decision so far in my life. I asked the team to let me out of my contract. I never left the job because I had a new one lined up. I left it because I wanted a blank slate, which I think is the biggest opportunity there is. Now I'm pretty much telling my own story. I'm trying to create moments worth sharing, if it's through social media or podcasting or even my fashion label. It's called Paris and I think it's more than a hoodie with just my initials on it. It's part of my lifestyle here in Newport Beach, California. Others say luck is when opportunity meets preparation. But don't underestimate timing. Everybody could have taken all the photos and videos I took, but I took them. I was there at the right place at the right time. Yes, I got very lucky, but also I may have a talent for timing. Lately I started a love of camping. So I took a rooftop tent on my SUV, I'm driving out in the desert, maybe on a Tuesday or a Wednesday, and then I explore the nature. I look for places worth telling that story, and I really, really enjoy that. The best thing you can do is create memories, moments that others remember. Basically being alone makes me act instead of react. Like when there's tons of people around, I only react. I try to react here and there. When I'm truly creating, that's normally when I'm alone. The freedom of truly deciding what to do with my time is probably my biggest success.